What's up, this is Ross with Tactics. Right now you're checking out the Huff Hopper 2 Low. Looks like a classic Huff, but it is upgraded with a lot of new technology that I think makes it uh, one of their better all around shoes. Uh, first thing you notice is it does have vulcanized construction, kind of an extended foxing tape. There's a lot of rubber as you wrap all the way around. Um, that's just gonna give you more durability and rubber with your flick for more grip and give you a more secure heel cup just for uh, support. On the bottom you do have the Huff Infinity Rubber designed specifically for skateboarding to be a little softer and grippier and last longer, more durability, always appreciated. On the toe cap you do have a small suede toe cap um, which is actually treated by an abrasion resistant spray. Not exactly sure how all that works but what I do know is that underneath that toe cap, you do have a rubber toe cap. So once you break through all of this, there is kind of a lot of seams, but once you break through, you are gonna get rubber underneath and that will definitely make the shoe last a lot longer. Um, other interesting things about it is it does have a antimicrobial midsole, just supposed to make your shoes a little less stinky because I know that's a problem for everybody. Uh, another nice thing is they do have an updated insole. It's always good to see a nice quality insole in a vulcanized shoe because sometimes they can be a little thin and don't offer a whole lot of support. So they've got a dual density foam insole. So it's a little firmer material throughout and then they have a little softer foam, this green stuff on the outside with some perforations just to lighten the shoe up a little bit. The upper is mostly canvas up here, very thin, not a whole lot of padding. So it's gonna move very freely, but it's not gonna add whole lot of protection when you start smacking yourself in the foot with your skateboard. Overall, very flexible feeling shoe. Uh, the toe does seem a little stiffer, so it might take a little longer to break in that toe, but once you put some hours into it, I'm sure it'll loosen up and give you that nice classic Volk feel that you know and love from Huff. Uh, you have this mustard color, which I think looks really nice, and then you have your black and white classic, and then your all white. If you want to know anything more about these shoes, go ahead and uh, head over to the site on tactics.com or drop a comment in the box below and we'll get back to you.